But, uh, okay, I was caught a little off guard. I just need to get a deck of cards out of here, if I can help this. doesn't mean much now. It used to mean a lot. Fortunately, I'm using cards and they don't know the difference. Mm -hmm. So it works as an incentive. I'll get two cards. So I'm using my pocket and a quarter as an incentive. Oh, you want to see? Right here. Right here. Thank you. They couldn't see in the back. Thank you. Sit down. Sit down. Here, go ahead. Yeah. Have a seat. Good. Comfortable? Thank you. Thank you for coming. I hope. <laughs> okay. So, I'm using, as I said, my pocket and I'm using this as a quarter as an incentive. So, and it's an incentive to attract the cards to my pocket. So I'm going to use one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. And the idea is. Pocket. Okay. Oh, I don't want you to memorize it necessarily, but just just see if you can remember any one card or something like that. In case it's not important, but just so that you realize the cards stay the same all the time. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now, there. what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to push the cards in here like that, and then I'm going to use this as an incentive, and then I'm going to go like this, like this, and push it in here and say, go! And the card, if it's behaving right, goes up my arm, across my back, a little ticklish here, <laughs> goes up in my arm, across my back, down this side, a little ticklish, it goes through here a little bit. And I think it's arrived. So we got one card that's come, come over, okay? So I'm gonna move this over. Again, and we go like that. We say go, and it goes up my arm. <laughs> a little ticklish just through here, across my back, under the arm, and <laughs> squeak. I can hear it. I'll, maybe someone can hear it too. Okay. Two. Okay, so let's go. Now look, I'm going to send two at a time. Now, don't do this at home. It's a little dangerous, okay? I'm an expert. I think. Okay. Here we go. One, two. Get separate under here sometimes. There we go. <laughs> uh, card number. <laughs> <laughs> I think they've arrived. Yeah, okay, card number. One. Three. Card number four. And how? No, they actually came wrong. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll get them. So this leaves us with one, two, three, four, five. Okay. 
Okay? And uh, again, push this into the can like that. And then go. Again, it got stuck under here. No, here. Okay, there it is. The <laughs> tip is it goes back behind my back, under this arm. And I'm not going to laugh now because I'm, I'm a professional. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's uh, three, four, five. Okay, so let's go. I'm going to send two at a time. Very dangerous. So be careful. Okay. One, two, uh -huh. wow. Four of hearts, this is nine of spades, okay? Which one would you like to go first? Me? Is that nine which one? Um, nine of spades. The nine of spades first, okay. So that's one you're gonna go first, okay? Push them in. Whoops. Go. And nine of spades, it's on its way. Again, get stuck under here sometimes. <laughs> under this arm. I think. <laughs> nine of spades. <laughs> one more time, I'm going to let you watch it now. Be quick. Because you see it go. You gotta be fast though. Go. See it go? Wow. Card. And what I'm going to do 
But anyway, I got this here. Did I answer the question? Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the question. <laughs> um, okay. I learned this one from my father. I, it's my thumb. And this is the rope, okay? Put it around like that, and I twist it around my thumb like that. And now, notice that if I pull, my thumb's gonna come off, right? Or the rope's gonna break. Right. And so I get killed. So yeah. <laughs> no harm to the rope. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, it's okay too. <coughs> now this one I did learn from my father. This one. So he didn't magic, but the story what he, he knew, I think. I, I don't know where he picked it up, but he got the rope around all my fingers, right? Yeah. Now if I do this, I got my thumb free, right? Now I get this finger free, right? Free. Wow. Yeah. Now I want to do, I want to do something bigger. But that was a test. I wanted to get through my whole body, right? And this was terrible. I had a terrible time. <clears throat> I get this, this, and this, and this. I kept doing it. And the only thing that happened is I get sores all around my body. I couldn't get it through. And <clears throat> so I worked on it. Then I realized what was wrong. There were bones inside here. <laughs> uh, but these are, the ribs are here, they go down to here, and then up here is the hip bones. There's a space in between, but it's still the spinal column. But the spinal column is a little thinner than everything else. So if you get it to the right place, you know, I have it here, I get it in the wrong place, I'm not gonna get it through. <coughs> so, get it in the right place, and if I pray, <laughs> Yay! Give a number between two and three. <laughs> 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 
Now, okay. I think I'm at three or four, okay? Three or four. Two. What's that? Four. Four, okay? Now you know what an art is? You know what an art is? You don't know. Not, don't know. No, not. You don't know what an art is, okay? A knot is K N O T. Knot. You know what a knot is? <laughs> and you named how many? What was the number you named? Four. Four. <clears throat> These are called overhand knots. The very first knots, you know, we know it from <coughs> uh, studies on, on, on rocks and stuff like that that cavemen used to do. That this kind of knot was the first, very first knot ever that people were able to do. And they went for his other knots. <coughs> okay, but I'm going to go again. Name a number between three and four again. Yeah. Was that half? <laughs> That's a good one. Uh, if I could do it, I would do it. I don't know what a half knot looks like, though. <laughs> what would a half knot look like? So, so instead of some some number between ten, two and four, five. Two. How many? Three. Three. Okay. There you go.